Hello, I'm Scott with the Scotch Malt Whiskey Society bringing you July's Hidden Gems. These are three casks, three bottles living on the website uh, that I believe for the summertime, for wintertime, for fall, spring, any of them, these are three great whiskeys that you do not want to pass up and you would regret not having on your shelf. The first is cask 10.232. This is a nine year old Isla in our heavily peated flavor category. And believe me, this one is an excellent example of the, that heavy peated Isla distillate. This is nine years old, aged in ex bourbon hogsheads. The nose greets you with a malty, citrusy lemon peel that's nutty, uh, just covered in smoke and on the palate really transports me to a beach where you're sitting by the campfire grilling some white fish uh, add some water to this and uh, spinach a pine nut uh, cream sauce comes out uh, just a beautiful example uh, again a nine-year-old isla heavily peated uh, distillery tin and you do not want to pass this one up my second pick cask 44.160 May Gusta Mucho is a 19 year old from a Speyside distillery that we have seen some younger whiskeys from. Uh, this is the oldest whiskey that I remember seeing from distillery 44. Uh, double maturation, ex bourbon, and then first fill Oloroso uh, in our deep rich and dried fruits profile. This was a US exclusive. The nose jumps out of the glass on this one, uh, meeting you with a savory meatiness. There's a uh, sweet sherry notes, toastiness, and nuttiness all at the same time. On first sip, your palate just becomes overwhelmed with a uh, sweet sherry, dry sherry, dark sherry, nuttiness, salty Italian meats, all the savoriness that we come to expect from Oloroso finish finishes. This is one that saturates into your gums and into your teeth and you can run your tongue right along those teeth after you, after the finish and just pick up more notes. With a drop of water on this one, savoriness starts to come through more of that dry Oloroso character and the sweetness on this one starts to take a back seat. Okay, There's a wonderful whiskey from a distillery that we don't normally see these older aged whiskeys from. Third pick in my July Hidden Gems is the Maverick. A uh, special release for the 40th anniversary of the Scotch Malt Whiskey Society. This was a batch release uh, finished in Spanish Oak, Oloroso, and Pedro Jimenez uh, casks. The, this is a Speyside single malt whiskey, 12 years old, bottled at 50% ABV. The nose is just phenomenal with sweet sherry, stewed fruits, and slight spices. Spend some time with the palate on this one, neat. You'll start to get notes of both Oloroso and Pedro Jimenez, those nice dry Oloroso notes, but some of that sweet syrupy sweetness from the Pedro Jimenez. All kinds of nice desserts, caramel de, de leche, vanilla creams, chocolates, just a wonderful whiskey neat. Adding water to this one brings out more of the sweetness, more of the chocolates, more of the cream showing, and the sweet uh, Pedro Jimenez uh, sherry fruits. So that concludes my July Hidden Gems. Again, these are three casts that are available still. You do not want to pass these up. They are excellent examples of our whiskeys and belong on everybody's shelves. See you next time. Cheers.